Hello everyone! Good morning! And this is again Teacher Grace and welcome to our dance exercise for today. So this is our fourth week of our online class and before we do our lesson for today, let's have an energizer or a dance exercise so that everybody will be fit and healthy and will be alert and awake. Okay, so we will dance the... Uh, title of the dance is Gummy Bears and I know everybody know about this dance but of course Teacher Grace will teach you first and then on the next uh, song we will dance it all together. So if you are all ready please uh, look and listen and later on we will dance the Gummy Bear dance. Okay so for the first music Teacher Grace will be the one to dance and on the second one you will be joining with me. Okay. So let's play the music. Okay. Okay, so oh, you need to bear, do like this. Push. Okay. And Everybody, please stand up and everyone will dance the gummy bear dance with Teacher Grace. So if you are ready, stand up please. And let's play the music. This is so easy, right? Okay, go! Oh, I'm a gummy bear. Yes, I'm a gummy bear. Oh, I'm a yummy, tummy, funny, lucky gummy bear. I'm a jelly bear. Three times 
that we finish studying. So today, we will move on to the next letter, okay? So the first one that we have here, so we finish with letter N. Oh, I think it's letter O. So the next letter is letter P, okay? This is the letter P. Can you say it again? This is the letter P, and it stands for pot. Okay, this is a pot. And the sound of letter P is pop. Okay, this is Okay, and the sound of letter P again is P. This is letter P and it stands for pot. And the sound of letter P is P. Okay, very good. The next letter that we have here is the letter Q. Okay, this is the letter Q and it stands for kilt. Can you say it again? Q. This is letter Q and it stands for Kilt. Okay, so the sound of letter Q is k, k, okay, as in k, k, kilt or k, k, queen. Okay, this is letter Q. And the last letter that we have for today is the letter R. It stands for rocket and the sound, the sound of R is r, r. Okay, so this is rocket, the letter R. So we finished studying with our three letters again today. We have the letter P for pot and the sound of P is P. We have the letter Q for kilt, okay, for quilt, okay. And the sound of uh, the letter Q is K, -k okay. And the last one that we have here is the letter R for Rocket and the sound of R is r, r, or r, r, rocket. Okay, so I hope you learned something about our three letters P, Q, and R. And tomorrow again, we will move on to our next alphabet recognition. Okay, we will study again about the alphabet. Thank you, everybody, and I hope you enjoyed the video today. Okay, thank you. Bye bye. Good morning, everyone. Welcome again to our English class. My name is Teacher Grace, your teacher body, and Teacher Grace is so happy. This is our fourth week and second day of our English class. And yesterday, Teacher Grace teach you or uh, taught you about the different kinds of shapes. Do you still remember? Okay, good job. So today, we will still be studying about the different kinds of shapes. Okay, so before we go to our activity for today, we need to study first the different kinds of shapes. Are you ready to listen? Okay, good job everybody. Please put your hands up, put your hands down, sit down properly and listen to me. Okay, thank you everyone. So for our basic shapes, we have... What shape is this, Kinder? This is circle. Good job. Can you say it again? Circle. One more time. Can you say it again? Circle. Okay, this is 
circle. Good job. This is circle. The next thing that we have here is the, what shape is this? Very good. This is a square. Can you say it again? Square. Good job. How about this one? What shape is this, Kinder? This is triangle. Can you say it again? Triangle. Very good. This is triangle. How about this one? What shape is this, Kinder? This is rectangle. Good job. This is rectangle. The next one that we have here is very good. This is a star. Can you say it again? Star. This one is heart. Okay, this one is heart. Can you say this again? Heart. And the last one is oblong. Can you say it again? Oblong. Okay, so these are the different kinds of shapes that we studied yesterday and today. And for our activity today, as you can see in my background, we have here different objects. Okay, so we will match the different shapes to its object. Okay, so teacher Grace will show you some of the basic shapes and we need to find, okay, the objects that match to our shape. Okay, the first one that we have here is what what shapes is this? What shape is this? This is circle. So we will find out which is circle. Is the heart circle? Yes or no? No. Is the window circle? Yes or no? No. Good job. Is the, what is this? The football, the football, is this one a circle? Yes or no? No. How about the door? Is this circle? Yes or no? No. How about the pizza? Is this circle? Yes or no? No. How about the star? Is this circle? Yes or no? No. How about the basketball? Is this circle? Yes or no? Yes, you got it right. So the basketball, the shape of the basketball is circle. Can you say it again? Circle. Very good. The, sh the, the ball is, the basketball is circle. Good job, everybody. How about this one? Oblong. Can you say it again? Oblong. So we need to find the, the match of this to the object. Okay. Is this heart an oblong? Yes or no? No. Is this window an oblong? Yes or no? No. Is this football an oblong? Yes or no? Yes, good job. The football is, the shape of the football is an oblong. Very good, kinder. Good job. Okay, the next one. How about the heart? Okay, let's find out, okay, which is, or let us match the proper shape of this to the object. Okay, is this ball a heart shape? Yes or no? No. Is this a star a heart shape? Yes or no? No. Is this pizza a heart shape? Yes or no? No. Is this door a heart shape? Yes or no? No. Is this football a heart shape? Yes or no? No. Is this window a heart shape? Yes or no? No. Is this heart a heart shape? Yes or no? Yes. Good job, everybody. This heart is a heart shape. Good job. Okay, so let's move on to the next one. How about this? This is a star. Very good. This is a star. Okay, let's find out. Is this a star? Yes or no? No. 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 Is this a star? Uh-huh. Is this a star? Yes or no? Yes. Good job. I'm testing you if, you if you know if this is a star or not. So this is a star. Good job, everybody. I hear someone saying, Oh, that is the star teacher. You skip it. Yes. This is a Star. Good job, everyone. Okay, how about this one? The shape is rectangle. Can you say it again? Rectangle. Okay, this shape is 
Rectangle. Is this rectangle? Yes or no? No. Is this rectangle? Yes or no? No. Is this rectangle? Yes or no? Yes or no? No. Is this rectangle? Yes or no? Yes. This is rectangle. Okay. Is okay. This is rectangle. Look at this. Okay. This is rectangle. Good job. Okay, the next one that we have here is triangle. Is this triangle? Yes or no? No. Is this triangle? Yes or no? No. Is this triangle? Yes or no? No. See? Is this triangle? Yes or no? No. Is this triangle? Yes or no? Yes. The shape of the pizza is triangle. Good job. And the last one for today is square. Can you say it again? Square. So, is this a square? Yes or no? No. Is this a square? Yes or no? Yes. The window, the shape of the window is square. Good job, everybody. So, I hope you learned something about the shapes. Okay? The basic shapes that we study today. Okay? The basic shapes that we study to, uh, today. It has objects uh, all over the house or if you look around there's an object that has basic shape so i hope you enjoyed the activity for today matching the proper shape to its objects okay but it's time to say goodbye and thank you everybody for always listening to my online class and i hope to see you soon bye bye everyone see you i love you everyone bye bye